Well, as we continue to rebound from the pandemic, one Bay Area County is already seeing the benefits in dollar signs. Manatee County's tourism industry is booming like never before. And tonight, business owners telling ABC Action News reporter J.J. Burden they need this big boost in revenue to rebound back to normal. No mask, only fun and sun from here on out for Paul Ryan. This is going to be my new bathing suit. <laughs> and it's a Tampa Bay Lightning mask. Go Lightning. We caught up with Paul on vacation on Anna Maria Island. It's a hot spot right now for a lot of tourists. This is fantastic. It's just great to be outside with everyone, having a great time, having a beer or two. For Gail Looper, it's a blessing. We're up 199% over last year. Never seen anything like that. She owns the Bungalow Beach Resort. This May, we're just slammed, and we're thankful for trying to catch up from all that cash flow from last year. And this time last year, the pandemic forced a countrywide shutdown. And for the first time in 20 years, and left Gail questioning the future of her business. It was pretty bizarre. You know, I've been through a lot. I've been through recession, red tide, hurricane, BP crisis. This was a total shutdown by basically by the government. It was something we had never experienced before. She used a small business loan and her savings to save a resort, and now she's reaping the benefits. People are just, you know, waking up and going, let's go to the beach. Manatee County leaders say just about every business on their beaches are booked and busy right now. Oh yeah, it's a great thing, positive thing to see everybody coming out. You know, actually, I can see a lot of return guests coming out here. According to a spokesperson, the county made over $3 million in bed tax in March. And that's 15% higher than 2019, which was a record-setting year for the county's tourism. Shocking, shocking and good. It actually helped benefit. And county leaders and business owners are now hoping it stays this busy for the rest of the year. In Manatee County, J.J. Burton, ABC Action News.